Right, guys, here we are back in Microsoft Access, and we looked at headers and grouping and all of that in the previous videos. Now we're going to look at the footers, group footers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just create a uh, report wizard. I'm going to just create a basic report, okay, based on the consultant's table. Last name, first name, we're going to do suburb and phone and email. Okay, we're going to group according to suburb. Just it's the quickest, easiest one to do. So click on next. We're going to group according to suburb. So far, so good. Nexty, nexty, next. And we're just going to finish that for now. Done. Right. So there is my form. It is my form. I there is my report. It is done. And I've grouped it according to the suburb. So I'm going to switch to design view. I'm going to make suburbs stand out a little bit, okay, because I really do want it to stand out, just so you guys can see, like, really where it is. Okay, so just move that over there. And let's have a look and see. Lovely. I love it. Right, so there you go. I haven't formatted anything here in terms of the, the length and size of the fields and stuff. Okay, I'm just focusing on the grouping at the moment in our reports. Back to design view. Back to design view. Here we go. So I'm in design view and the thing that I want here is a footer. So as you can see, I've got a suburb header, but what if I was asking you to calculate things that were specific to the suburb? I would want them in the footer. Normally I'd say, you know, work out in the footer or insert a footer. How do I do that? So let's go ahead and do that. So I've clicked on suburb header. I'm just going to close this panel over here. And again, there's always more than one way, guys, to do the same thing. So I'm going to go and click uh, right click and I'm going to say sorting and grouping. Do you see where I right clicked? Okay. When in doubt, right click. Right click on suburb header and I go to sorting and grouping. There it is over there. And I click and it brings this up. And you might have seen this in a previous video. So it says here, group on suburb, because we grouped according to suburb with A on top. So it's sorting according to uh, A, B, C, D. And then, oh, just sorry, I, I like jumped ahead there. But do you see that I clicked on uh, that little more options there? Let me just show you more clicked over there and it says by entire value no totals with a title with a header section and we know it's got a header section so it says with a header section and here it is here guys without a footer section that's it there that's what you're looking at so let's go and change it to with a footer section and if you have a look there's my header there's my footer it created a suburb footer yes yes I'm gonna take that away take that away. So what if you're back here and you're like, oh, I can't remember what to do and you didn't right click and all that stuff. Well, guys, what you do is you click on suburb header and you have a look at your ribbon at OK and you go to report design. There it is there, report design. My header is selected and I can say group and sort. There it is there. So if you forgot to right click, use your ribbon, report design, group and sort and then follow the same steps. Group on suburb, A on top, more, yes please, all the way across to with a footer section. Thank you very much. Let's just close that there. And now we have a footer section where we can go and add, if I'm still in report design here, and I can go and add uh, some text fields or some labels into this section. And in the next video, I'm going to show you how we do some basic calculations in this. All right. So let's, um, let's move on to the next video.